And you can go inside and sit in the, on the middle table, okay. and then they'll tell you when the, all the other stuff is okay. Keep this one and put that one in the box right here. Right. So when they pick one, they'll check if you have a match. Good luck. Thank you. Okay, it's quarter past six and we start right on time, even though, again, people are still floating in. Once again, thank you so, so much for coming out uh, on this evening, a horrible evening, windy, rainy, all that good stuff. Uh, and thank you, too, while we have a captive audience, to all the agency people who schlepped their things in through wind and rain and sleet and it's supposed to snow later. Gotta love My name is Marsha Picard. I work for an organization called Greater Fall River Partners for a Healthier Community. We run these family fun nights in schools all over the Greater Fall River area. However, to this point, they've been pretty much held in the, Fall, in the city of Fall River itself. This is the very first one that we have run outside of Fall River. Our organization, Partners for a Healthy Community, covered Somerset and Swansea and Fall River and Westport. And we wanted to come to some of the other towns to, to bring these family fun nights to your school. I have been told that the Chase Elementary School is an especially good school. So I am very, very excited. We all are excited that this is the first one, this is the first family fun night that we have run outside of the city of Fall River. And with the weather the way it is, and the fact that you still come out, just, just, just uh, builds up my confidence and lets me know that everything that people told me about Chase Elementary School is absolutely true. So can you please give yourselves a hand? Extraordinary. I also thank you very much before we even get started, your principal who's been so supportive about getting this all going. Can we give him a hand right at the beginning? <laughs> and also sometimes the unsung heroes, the custodial staff who are good enough to move tables and chairs around for us this evening. One is here, Matt is here this evening with his son, Sebastian. <laughs> to work because you're anxious to get going and not hear me talking anymore. Uh, this is all about fun, it's all about family, so we've got lots of families here, we've got people ready to provide you with lots and lots of fun. When you came through the front door, you received a, a little sticker that was either green or pink or orange. The whole family should have gotten the same color, unless you don't want to move together with your family, but that's your issue, not mine. Uh, okay, so you've got your, you got your stickers on. Uh, that divides you into three groups, so anyone who has a green sticker will be moving just with people who have the green stickers and the orange and the pink, and so forth. Uh, you are going to be going to one of three stations. In just a couple of minutes, I'm going to send you off to three, one of three stations. One is the station right here. There are two agency representatives from 22 agencies that serve the greater Fall River area that have all kinds of good information to share with you, and lots of them have freebies, too, so you like that part, too. Everything here tonight is free. The second station is going to be a, an informational station on Nutrition Ed, which is going to be fun. It's nice and interactive. That's going to be down in the kindergarten area. And then we're going to move you all into the gymnasium, where we have two folks there that are going to give you a workout. I want to see everybody working. This is a family fun night, so we're going to have a lot of fun. It's the kind of exercise that everybody is able to do. So I want older people, younger people, everybody up and moving. I know you're really, really going to enjoy that. You're going to be in each station, at each station, for 20 minute intervals. At tw after 20 minutes, we are going to rotate you, so everybody gets to do everything for 20 minutes at a time. After those three 20 minute stations, you're all going to come back into this room, because that's when we do the door prize drawing. You, each family should have received a door prize ticket when you came in. You have to be here to win, we didn't take any names. So if you decide you're going to go home early, you won't have a chance to get the door prize because there's no follow-up. So you're all going to want to come back in here as far as the um, door prize drawing is concerned. Okay, everybody understands how it works. Everybody knows where they're going? Go! Yeah, yeah, all right, just put oh, the yeah, stuff you down and come join in this big circle. Because we call it Family Fun Day, that means everybody participates. Otherwise, it's not Family Fun Day. The purpose of tonight is just to kind of get your bodies moving and 
have some fun and talk a little bit about exercise, but in a fun way, in a way that doesn't make you really feel like exercise or that we're actually doing any kind of work that's not fun, because it will be. So for the first one, we're gonna need all the young people to maybe help the adults and show them exactly what kind of uh, movement thing we're gonna do. And then later on, the adults are gonna help the, the younger people, so it's kind of like a good way to teach each other. All right, so we're gonna play some music.
So how much, how much, how much, how much, how many grams of sugar is in a teaspoon? Four, good. You're reading the fingers really well. Okay. <laughs> It looks like this. So basically, that B is what fun did for the And now, you're going to do something else. All these young people over here. Adults, I need you to learn with the kids. Um, now, you're going to show the adults how to do a dance move, okay? Oh my God. Yep, you know how. The new, the Casper Slide Part 2. Featuring the Don't pay attention to me, I don't know what I'm doing. We're going to get it. gymnasium but I kept stopping by there and they were giving you all a pretty good workout so can we give them a hand as well <laughs> and also we're very appreciative to the to the folks who volunteered to sit at the front table too I don't know if they're still in or where we can where they can hear us but please give them a hand here. this night was all about fun it was all about family it was all about nutrition and it was all about fitness uh, it's so important that we look after the health of our children. There are so many statistics, there are so many reports, there are so many surveys out there that tell us what we need to be do, doing in terms of keeping our children healthy. But let me tell you the one that bothers me the most. It's the one that experts are saying where if our children keep eating the way that they are, not good, getting the lack of exercise that they are, leading that sedentary lifestyle that so many of them are, that theirs will be the first generation in history to have a shorter lifespan than the generation that precedes it. That should scare us beyond anything else. So we really need to look at what they're eating, we really need to look at what they're doing in terms of getting exercise. Back a hundred years ago when I was a child, we came home from school, we went out and we played. We played and we played and we played and we played. 
because we had television that didn't come on until 4 o'clock in the afternoon. We only had three channels. There was no such thing as a remote control. You got up and you changed the channel. But you went out and played with your neighbors because you knew your neighbors. You rode your bike, you felt comfortable, you felt safe, and so forth. It's a whole different world. We all understand that. But you really need to be looking at the exercises that children, your children are getting or are not getting. And again, what they are eating and not eating. The uh, partners, the uh, table, I hope you all went by and noticed the soda and, and juice there. You know, when I was a little girl, it was like, oh, you can drink all the juice you want. Not so much. There's a lot of sugar and juice. So we need to watch, again, what we're feeding our children. Okay, I hope you had fun. I hope you learned a lot. I uh, hope you enjoyed yourself tonight. I am so impressed that you came out in this kind of weather. It doesn't sound like it's letting up. You might all be here for the evening. Are there sleeping arrangements here? <laughs> No, I am so impressed, and I am extraordinarily grateful that you would come out on this kind of an evening. We're, we're very, very, very grateful to you. Now, we have some door prizes to draw. You should all have gotten one free door prize ticket when you came in. We have lots of door prizes. We have some door prize, a door prize that was donated by Network Health. That's going to go first. And then Partners, the organization for which I work, has donated five bags of groceries in which there are lots and lots of goodies like Cheerios, pasta, peanut butter, tuna fish, uh, rice, apples, carrots, onions, garlic. Did I say Cheerios? Yes, I said Cheerios. Lots and lots and lots of good things, things that are good for you. So let's see. So we're going to have six lucky families tonight. You are all so good to come out in this kind of weather. I wish I had a door prize for every single one of you. But I'm going to ask your principal to come up here and draw the numbers. I always like to have the principal draw the numbers for two very good reasons. One reason is he knows you all and I don't. So if the Jones family wins, he can say, oh, it's the Jones family. So there's that nice personal touch. touch. The other reason I always ask the principal to do the door prize. Exactly. <laughs> he catches on. The reason I ask the principal to draw the, the door prize drawings is because if he doesn't draw your number, it's not my fault. <laughs> just like, see, see how that works? Okay, here we go. This is for the network health basket. All kinds of goodies in the basket. 027531 <laughs> 027546. <laughs> Last but not least, 027560. Last round of applause if we could from Archer and your associates. Thank you very much.